All right, so this is gonna be a quick video just because of the temperature and I've gotta do, I'm gonna change the oil on the 4066. Uh, so far, I've got almost six hours on the blower according to the PTO timer on the tractor. Um, so I've used it for about six hours. Absolutely love it. Uh, it has performed wonderfully. Um, absolutely no complaints. Uh, the quick hitch is slowly working itself out. It's just a matter of it's just really tight in there. Um, so it's just a matter of it getting it set bound in there and everything. Um, I think most of that six hours is on video. So you've probably seen a number of videos or you will see a number of videos. I don't know how they'll lay out. I'll probably put this uh, in there somewhere since it's something a little different. Um, got 172 hours on the tractor right now. Uh, so it is definitely time to change the oil. I'm very well past my, my 50 or 60 hour goal that I normally have for uh, changing oil. Uh, but anyway, to change the oil, pretty simple procedure. Um, drain the oil out. I've got my little picked up that space heater right there just because it's, I don't know, 10 degrees back here in the shop and I just didn't want to get my hands too cold and I've got to wear, uh, I've got gloves on underneath the nitro gloves, but at the same time, it's just not very warm. Uh, so I'm going to drain the oil out, uh, pull, pull the oil filter, which is in there, uh, replace the oil filter, better make sure I have an oil filter first, and then fill her back up. Um, can't remember where the oil fill was at. I'm wondering if I have to take the side panel off. Maybe it's on the other side. Can't remember. Uh, I'll have to find that. Um, I've only changed oil on this thing once. Uh, like I said, I'm not too happy about that. I should have changed it a month ago. But anyway, we're going to do that. I'll uh, come back as I have progress and as my hands get warmed up and everything. So off we go. All right, well, got the oil changed. Um, it was almost 173 hours. I didn't realize how how long it had been. Unfortunately, I couldn't tell you the last time I changed the oil um, because I couldn't read the writing on the oil filter. So uh, it's got a got brand new plus 52. If you can see the kitty litter or the oil dry down there. Uh, naturally, if you look back at the beginning part of this video, I had a little itty bitty metal pan under there. I'm not really sure what possessed me to want to uh, put that underneath there with a new this thing actually had quite a bit of oil in it so made a little bit of a mess but that's okay uh d double checked it oil's right where it should be so we should be good to go makes me feel a little bit better about using this thing um i will also hear probably later this week uh, it looks like um actually not that it'll be later this week but it looks like in the long range forecast um it looks like we will get some uh some snow and um, it looks like we're gonna get quite a bit of snow and uh, so I'll need to grease the blower here um, got to do the chain I'm gonna the chains a little loose I gotta lead, read the spec on the chain and it was set up when I got it um, so I'll have to check that and see where the tension needs to be on the chain um, so yeah uh, overall really like this setup I've uh, got numerous comments asking why I didn't get a front mount blower. Um, so here's some dollar, some dollar amounts for this blower. So I paid $4,600 for this one, brand new. Now these are all brand new numbers, all right? If I wanted the front mount front end loader hydraulic blower, so the hydraulic blower, um, it'd be like the SB12 or 1374. I think that's the number, um, or 20... 2270, 2274, 2174. I can't remember. Um, that blower brand new is $14,000. The SB 11 or 1274, which is the upgraded version of the, the 1174 is $6,800. Um, now that's also a rear mounted blower. I'm just giving you all the blowers that I priced. A front PTO with 540 PTO, uh, a front three point with 540 PTO for this tractor uh, is, depending on how you source it, uh, you can't get a 540 through deer. Um, you can get a thousand through deer, but either option, it's about $7,500 to get a front three point and PTO. Um, so 
if you want a five, yeah, if, if you get a 540, it's also about $7,500 plus install. Install is not easy. Uh, basically, you have to take the entire, it's a, it's a very involved install. I'm guessing it'd probably take about eight hours. Um, ultimately, yes, I would like a front uh, three point with a blower on it. I think that would be really nice. Um, and certainly something that's in the future but you know coupled so you got that 7500 for the front pto and three point plus the 4000 for the blower you're looking at right around 12,000 tax tag title everything else um i did find a used hydraulic front end loader mount skid steer mount blower with a hydraulic power pack they wanted five thousand dollars for it and it was hashed out um absolutely hashed out the the blower housing uh, right here um, that thing look yeah it just it was toast um, I found another one after the fact that they also wanted I think they wanted 5500 for that one uh, but it was over four hours away so um, in the end that's why I went with the rear mount blower I do want a front mount blower and as we move forward in the future or I'll keep the the rear mount and I'm gonna add an angled blade uh, to the front end loader so ultimately that's what we're going to do um, you can also add a blade to the three point if you put a front three point on it uh, i most likely will get a front three point some point in the future um, but that's seventy five hundred dollars so if anybody wants to graciously start donating to me i would be more than happy to take it and i will you know exactly what i'll buy with it i'll buy john deere stuff but um anyway that's what it is um really like the blower uh certainly helping me out quite a bit uh and it looks like it's going to get some more use before uh, March is done. So uh, right now, total in the next 15 days, we're supposed to get anywhere from 10 to 20 inches of snow. So we're going to keep plowing forward with it or blowing forward, whichever, or blowing backwards. So thanks for watching.